Right. Okay, hold on. I gotta finish my picture. No, you don't. Shut up. Oh, you're recording this? Yeah. And I'll say that. Cool kid. Really All right, cool. this is. I'm. I told you I what was I'm going doing. To send out a call for everybody, but apparently that's not necessary. <laughs> okay. I've been looking forward to this for a week. <laughs> oh, that's right. I should. Just quickly. <laughs> no. Cool. There we go. Uh, I hear you. Cool. Discord just literally decided to shut off. So give me <laughs> one second to upload. Cool kid. All right, this is the picture you should use for me. I drew it. <laughs> you, you can import your own images into the uh, into Perfect. Roll twenty. Uh, everybody, you you can uh, you should. Oh, oh, okay. If you can import your own images, then I'm going to let you import your own image because I'm not making people type that out. I was just going to How post a I fucking import... directly. Okay, well, fine then. Everybody, type this in to your browser and look at that. Because it's good. No, I'm not going. To. Oh. <laughs> no, you don't have to. It's sure. the link to your picture. Oh, okay. Well, I'm trying to put it in and I don't know. There we go. Here we go. Cool kid. <laughs> where, good name. Where is it? Saved you. It's on my character sheet. Oh, there we go. Yep, there we are. There she is. It's right there. All right. Uh, Cloak's blue because it's the cloak of a man. Or a... Okay. All right. So uh, I guess maybe we should start with like character introductions or something. Just because no. I I have no no idea like who anybody here is. So should let the DM not... DM the game. <laughs> I have an introduction for everybody. Oh, okay away please feel free to dm the game that you're dming right, let's uh well, i do need to double check uh one or two things here mm -mm -mm -mm. name we'll have to come up with one All right. Okay. So, for reasons that are your own, have come to the uh, Narathak trade port, Aneth. Hmm. Huh. I need to find where I can write notes on this. Oh. Whatever, I guess I opened up Notepad. It should be a notebook tab for that kind of stuff. No, there, I mean, like, I see a journal, but I don't, like, I can't write anything in there, I don't think. Create your own handouts? No, I can't, I, we can't create handouts because we're not, uh, not GMs. I'm just putting my shit in Notepad. Yeah, that's what I am. Okay, uh, what was, what was the stuff again? Local notes. Yep. That's fine. I think we're at the port of Minus. Uh, yes. Ah, oh, he is. Lannis, I got it. Lannis. Okay. Lannis. okay. Hey, the port has been between months to days. Why you're here. And something happened. What exactly it was that got you, and really different for each one of you. 
Maybe it was that last round of stout, the one with the odd aftertaste. Incense you bought at the market. From looked sketchy, but the her products looked fine. Sleeping at the inn. Only to be woken up when someone bashed your skull with a sap. <coughs> Knows where. Whatever the case. Find yourself in a small wooden room on board of a ship. From the fact that uh, steady rocking motion, oh, the wooden changed. timbers around you. Oh. Huh. In this room here. Stacked up against the wall, hands and feet bound behind you, a gag in your mouth. With uh, crates and sacks. Odd smell to the air, more than just the salt of the sea, but you can't quite place it right now because things and the odd characters next to you get on the smell. Describe what you look like to each other, or from left to right, because that's simple. Left to right. So the who's roll twenty list? Ah, oh, okay, oh, so okay. Colin would be first. Oh, okay. Um, so my character looks mostly human. Uh, most mostly human, being that uh, their hair. While blonde, sort of has like this shimmering quality to it, and they have a very, very faint halo above their head. Um, other than that, uh, blue eyes uh, looks looks like like he's been very. They've been very uh, pretty. Like they're they're very attractive in a odd sort of way. Like. It's it's a different way for everybody, but uh, oddly attractive, and uh, they're wearing what appears to be a big cloak that's sort of like sewn into a uh, set of studded leather armor, and I don't think they would have it on their uh, their person at the moment, but they also have a um a a staff that looks just like a big stick, essentially. Not yes. very fancy, but right now you are only wearing the clothes on your back. Okay, so just the and if just your the... magic items and magic items are wearable, they are missing. Oh, okay, um, and also uh, they are barefoot, like completely barefoot. They they don't wear, sh they are not wearing shoes. Even if everybody else is wearing shoes, they are allowed to keep the shoes. They aren't wearing shoes. That's weird. Anyway, uh, that's my character and what they look like. Oh, or Nako. Nico. Hmm? Your character's name. Describe what Nico looks like. Nico. I was saying, uh, how do you pronounce that? Nako or Nico? Oh. Yeah. Sorry, my. Uh, uh, anyway, so Nico, right? It's like. Uh, how do you describe yourself? I'm, I'm bringing you up because. Um, I want oh, you and only you a history check. Three, it's street intelligence. Okay. Uh, history, history. There we go. It's just normal. Okay, I think this should work. I mean, roll the dice. See the roll. Uh, it, it went through. You got a 15. Yeah, it's 15. Okay. Just... So what does that tell me? How do you whisper in Roll20? That's a um, great question that has never come up the many um, uh, You can... I um, PM think it to him over... Discord, yeah, you guess. can just PM it yeah. on Discord. That, that would be uh, I mean, like better. I know I you can, can whisper. Hold on, let me let me try this. 
I think it I I think it's like slash W Yeah, it's slash W and then you uh, yep, yep. And then type you start, in someone's name. Yep. And then their name will pop up in like a little yellow box and you can yeah. click on it and I think yeah, I should have just whispered something to you, Bob. And so. yeah. yeah, it's just slash W. Okay. Let's see. You know, the many times I've run games over roll 20. Then... I know! That's never come up! <laughs> and yeah. It's come up for me, sort of, but, well, normally it's just Brood is whispering to me when, when playing Pendragon. Because <laughs> he'll. He, he figures shit out and then whispers it to me. So not to spoil other people. Nice. Not my first time, so I don't I tried to shit. use screen in one of the Call of Cthulhu ones. Because, like, some characters have an insight or whatever. Did you? Oh, I see. Oh, boy, I'm shitty at a lot of things. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> okay. Hemos, you're up. My character is it? Yeah. yeah. Okay. What you see before you is the half orc. Looks like half human with streaks of black hair upon his upon his head, green eyes and an earthly brown skin. A little bit paler at the moment. For a reason reason that's not very clear. But he looks tall and he's dressed in a very loose fitting but well-worn garb, uh, very, very fine fabric, almost, almost like a monastic uh, vibe from it, but you can't discern where exactly it comes from. <laughs> Is it my turn to describe my character? Or Just for background reference, um, the Empire has a fairly strong monastic tradition, but um, find monks anywhere else. Hmm. Else, I should say. Sorry, uh, it seems like you're cutting out a lot for me, Bob, and yeah. I'm not sure. If... Hmm. Like, I can well, mostly understand what you're saying, but occasionally a word gets lost. I don't know if... Hold on, I, me... I'm getting that kind of connection from other folks, too. Yeah, let me check the server settings real quick. Um, well, let's move it to U.S. Central? I don't know. Yeah, it, just, it just made yeah. a sound. It's fine. Oh. Well, no, Korea. Yeah, let me drop. Huh. All right. It actually seems well, to have disconnected from Discord entirely. Yeah, that definitely wasn't me changing servers from where it was. <laughs> yeah, that, okay. That's all what happens. Just so oh, we're very oh, clear. Yeah. Hey, Korea is alive again. Okay. Sorry about that. Yes, Julia, it is your turn. It's my turn? Okay. Uh, so, I guess the most... We still have our normal clothes, right? That's what you said? So... Begin, depending on what happened. Yeah, okay, so I've got real fancy clothes on. She's a uh, gray elf, which I guess is uh, a high elf. Um, she's got gold-ish skin. Uh copper hair and green eyes and she's dressed very fancily and she's got a ridiculous hat on her head like 
very impractical. It's got like at least 10 different types of feathers on it. <laughs> hmm. Okay, I'm done. <laughs> How how old does your character look? Uh, she looks twenty. Okay. She's an elf, so yeah. she's not. <laughs> yeah. My my character does a brief double take, but then realizes that no, Julie's character is not in fact her mom. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! What? <laughs> Whoa! It is your turn. Oh yes. Okay. So um. My character, she is also elven looking. Um, I suppose if someone were 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 good at at telling, they would probably be able to tell that she is in fact a half elf. Although she probably well, looks. Um, Sorry. To see if she's a half elf. <laughs> what? No, it's, it's, he's asking. He's making a joke to see if he can roll. The, see if you're a half elf. Oh, yeah, um, yeah, but she she probably looks a little more elven than the average half elf, or a little more exotic looking. At least she's got you know sort of bright red hair, and uh, she's probably pretty attractive looking. Uh, if you're into you know that sort of thing, um, and yeah, she's she's dressed probably pretty nicely, um, just in you know fairly fine clothes uh not not anything like impractically fancy just you know high quality uh casual clothes i guess um yeah i guess that's it i don't know i feel i need to clarify as well but yeah i need to clarify about my clothes i bought the fanciest clothes possible so they are in fact very impractical (laughs) just to be clear that that's fine. <laughs> to be fair, I think I think that uh that fine clothes you can kind of leave that to your imagination in terms of whether they're like fine like stupidly impractical or fine like just Oh mine are really very nice. poofy. Yes, <laughs> nice. I, uh, I understand. And then That's it. There's no one else. No, no, I, I, I meant as far who's as... Who's that in the corner? <laughs> They're going to the... Oh, you ruined my segue. Anyway, should I describe myself now? I'm the last in the queue. Yes. Uh, DM. So, uh... The character, uh... Uh, he's a goblin. And, uh, we're very... We're, um... You know, with like kind of straw like hair, like the color, and also, also like the bit, like the kind of elongated ears that we're all so known for. All of, like eyes that are, are like quite dark brown, in fact, almost black, almost uh, dead, like a doll's eyes, you know. But uh, no, I'm not wearing a wig. <laughs> and uh, those are like incredibly. Uh, Almost amazingly, just a kind of tunic. Looking at this character, you wouldn't really know that anything was off about him, except that he's a goblin and a kind of really known for his goblins. Goblins are really kind of known for being in the south and like kind of jumping around and being in tribes and all that kind of stuff. And uh, this guy is just um, yeah. just to be specific. I use a half work again. Runash, you in particular have known a few goblins in your time. Tend to be fairly petty and vicious. Oh boy. Even the ones that are absorbed by the Empire tend to be pretty mean, especially compared to the uh, the gnolls and the orcs you know. Yeah, my eyes are looking in that direction suspiciously, just curious as to why they're there. Bond. In fact, he doesn't seem to give anything away. I don't know. Is he lost in thought? Is he? What is he doing? Or other characters, I imagine, wouldn't be able to really get a read from him that easily. Like, I guess. Or you could roll insight against his deception if you did want to get a read. 
sure, yeah. yeah. A read against Let's have who? fun. Deception. Goblin. The goblin. I'm not trying to get a read on the goblin, I'm just trying to... It's an option. Uh, I'm just trying to figure out why, why he's there exactly, and just trying to figure out this entire situation, but... Fair enough. Because obviously this would be some sort of kidnapping. Although nobody's a kid here, I'd imagine. Mm -hmm. But it's like, why would they take a goblin among everyone else here? This seems out of place to me. Mm. So and also, racist. because everyone has talked about how attractive their characters are, I would like to say that my goblin is <laughs> goblin standards not very attractive. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wow! And he's also, actually, actually, he's just absolutely... you, are fairly, uh, you are fairly handsome for your race. Sure, I mean, go other goblins, you know, hey, but you know, he even or whatever, they just don't get it, which is fine. Hey, look, so I only said that because my character literally has charisma nineteen. Yeah, so. my my character's charisma is eighteen. So, okay, well, my this is my turn now. Oh, everyone's giving the game away. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so what do we do next? Oh, well, um, it's not long. And uh, someone peeks through and then shuts it. People walking around. Finally. We're tied up, right? Just to be clear on that. Yes, tied and gag. Yeah. Huh. You Jeez. could break your bonds, but it would take a very difficult roll. Or I could have <laughs> I could have my uh my my mouse friend shoot through my ropes. Wait, Present. could I could I try an acrobatics check to, to <laughs> slip out of my or sleight of hand? Because whoever tied your bonds is very good at tying knots. Damn. Uh, okay. Can I have my so, owl? You can't try. Actually, yeah, none, none of your uh, animals, companions, pets, in this tiny room. Well, he's not even See? magical. Why would they confiscate him? Sorry, to to be clear, Bob, and I didn't. Did you say that I could try, or a like... hard check? But you can always try. Okay. Well, if he's gonna do, it, if, if she's gonna do it, I'm gonna do it. <laughs> Bastion isn't even a magical mouse. It's a normal ass mouse. As far as well, I know, you can even teleport around on ships. Then think about it. Uh, but you, you got to consider they obviously went through your pockets. Yeah, I swear um, to God, also, if they why would they leave kill... a mouse in them? I swear I'm to God, if they killed my mouse, check. I'm going to be very angry at them. Unless you're very secure hiding spot. <laughs> no, no, no. Bastion does not go up there. <laughs> this right, yeah. sucks. I'm not even. I'm not even gonna bother trying to uh, break my my rope the ropes then because uh, my my strength has a modifier of negative one. So, <laughs> Lady Serial, uh, get out of her bonds, but uh, just shaves her wrists. Yeah, this I have sucks. a plus eight bonus to acrobatics, but I, I but I choose not to use it. <laughs> Why? Why? What is wrong with you? <laughs> Uh, I'm, I'm... Oh. Anything? Yes, 18 is not high enough. Like I said, it is very hard. Yeah, very Fair. hard is 20, right? You, you, you almost get that first uh, over your uh, hand, but it's just too tight on there. It's just... They knew, they knew what they were doing, whoever tied these. Damn. Uh, Nako observes them trying to struggle with the cuffs. Yeah, I just look at them and I'm just like, I miss my mouse already. Um, do you notice that there are three people down in the room with you? Hmm. What do they look like? Oh, they're assholes. Okay. <laughs> Just tell. 
staring gonna... and by the deference given to him. Obviously the captain, or at least the first officer on board this ship. Two of them are uh, tough-looking types. I'm going to glare at him. He's a couple of you struggling. Answer the obvious questions first. Good ship, the Naked Scallion. The Naked Scallion? <laughs> That's the greatest ship name ever. Like, my character is actually I'm thinking laughing. that. I'm laughing. This is a terrible name. No, oh, it's great. Shut up. <laughs> Through the gag, you're laughing, but... <laughs> but... Ship the Naked Scallion. Packed my men. And dragged to this place. Obviously, you're wondering why I brought a bunch of hard types onto my boat. <laughs> I keep laughing. Why is he doing this? Just let him monologue. I brought a bunch of hard types onto my ship. The of that is desperate times call for desperate measures. Man, brother. Since you can... Sh <laughs> Since you can hug the... Says you can hug the coastline on the way north. Are the waters off the east coast of the continent? Not guarding it anymore. Now it's the domain of the sea devils. Hmm. Made do by hiring mercenaries, adventurers from the south. Us independent types. Or we gotta use other means. Um, a sail for the south. You're still cutting out a lot. Uh, what's what's your um, gating looking like? Like your uh, sensitivity? 28 millisecond delay. No, no, I, I'm, t I'm talking about the input <clears throat> sensitivity. Like the the thing to automatically detect your voice, maybe you might want to turn it down. I've moved it down some. Okay. All right, go ahead and try. Okay, hopefully that'll help. Get a pick up from where I left off. Uh, need muscle. Companies of hired mercenaries and adventurers from the south. Who use another methods. I don't make enough money to hire a full party of adventurers. Solution. So. I offer you. Oh, God. Mm hmm. Hmm. I'm sorry. He needed adventurers, so he kidnapped some. That is. You should see. Some uh, this is. Thinking. This is. This is literally the notes that I just wrote that the stream can confirm that I wrote down. This. Continue where I. I what I was saying. Yeah. That sail to Port Zanzo. Looks at you. That none of you know how to sail a ship. Let's get to Port Zanzo. Safe and sound. Food. Water. Room you need. You kill the sea devils. And not us. I cannot believe this. <laughs> I cannot believe this. He could have just hired me. Well, I don't he, think he they actually mentioned that. Yeah, they, they don't have I the. I know, 
They don't have the money to hire us, so they just kidnapped us, and they're like... I mean, you know, I might have done it for free if they'd asked nicely. I... Well, he uh, uh, what is, motions uh, the two men standing question. next to him. And they move around the room. I was going to say, well... All their eyes room. that they will do something if you try and cast a spell. I don't have my fucking wand. I don't have my goddamn staff, so I can't really do much. Every spell has a material component. Not every spell. Not every spell, but all the ones that I think oh, I use to kill people not? with. Well, I don't have my weapons either, so I can't use my good weapon spell. So... Uh... It's a good thing they tie these up nice, because my weapons are right on me. <laughs> Alright, well... This guy's a speak, but if you attempt to cast a verbal component spell, <laughs> I'm not gonna do that. Probably, I'm not that stupid. Uh, so we're stuck, right? <laughs> That's we're stuck on a stupid boat. Yeah, with a bunch of dumb pirates. Yep, yep. That's the long and short of it. Just me. We're not pirates. I'm sorry, you're kidnapped. Wait, are, are we on gag now? I, I make a living moving merchandise from one place to another. Oh, so you're just well, at each location. They're just idiot so you merchants. Just kidnap people. Yeah. Just. So you know pirates kidnap people, right? You 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 now fit, you're on a boat and you kidnap people. You now fit the description of pirates. Um, I, while while they're haranguing this captain for really just doing what is businessly savvy, oh my roll god, roll to try and get my uh my a uh, bond. Uh, I've never tried to sit down and have a drink at without having a sailor's token on you. Now that's kidnapping. I don't. Anyway, I... press gangs, my dear. Perhaps you haven't been so far south as to see him. Oh I God. guess so. I guess we'll kill uh, your stupid so sea devil for you. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> Saying anything? So we we are all on gag now. Sighs heavily. Are are we on gagged? Yeah, I I think okay. we are. Yeah. Sorry, I'll, I was confused. I'll I kill your stupid. I'll help kill your stupid sea devils for you if you just like I don't know. Just ask next time. You don't have to kidnap people. You know, I was escorting a diplomat just to be very clear. Like, uh, you probably how, pissed off a diplomat. How just large saying. is your crew? <laughs> That's a good question. Is it just him and the other two? Sometimes, Bobbin, your thing lights up, but don't say anything. Well, they moved the sensitivity down oh, okay. too far. Okay. okay. Mm -hmm. I was just wondering if you were saying stuff and, like, you weren't coming through. That's fine. 13. We number 13 sailors. That's. We're on a schooner as fast as this one. I see, I see. Okay, so 13. <sighs> and then that means. Th I'm just doing, like, in my, in my head, my character is doing some quick math. Okay, so 13. They've kidnapped and pissed off five of us. So that means a little more than two each. I think we could take them. That's, that's going on in my head. Um, here's a quick question. Are these sea devils, like, pirates or actual devils that live in the sea? Before you can, before he can answer. I don't know. Perception. Perception? Okay. Perception. Cool. 
Uh, uh, all right. Twenty one. Uh, Let me find it on my list. There. Yep. There's my list. My. Did it roll? There we go. Hey. Fourteen. Oh boy. All right. In fact, distant horn. Weird, because you're on a ship that's at sea. God damn it! If we haven't left port yet, and he's been fucking with us. Uh, the, the, the waves are moving too regular. You're pretty sure you're already at sea. It could be magic. Well, here's the thing: is that the captain heard the horn, and his face just. Um, is that the sea devils you told us about? Is that a horn to let us know that sea devils are attacking? I bet it is. That's so they like is it that... or not. Our fates are now tied. Oh god damn it. Then you better untie <laughs> next it. room. And then come up to the top deck. Yeah, okay. Fine. Where's my gear? Yeah, I go Whatever get you do. My... Don't go overboard. Oh, I'll thanks, bud. <laughs> I would have never figured that out. Don't go overboard on a boat. <laughs> no, don't go overboard. Think about taking the ship's boat. All right. The devil's pet sharks will get you. The fuck are the devils? <laughs> Can I roll to see if I know there's Sahagin at this point? Uh, as Look, soon as I get my... He, he's, he's speaking sailor speak, Julia. Speaking oh. the tongue of the sea. Well, it Everything sucks. has to be cryptic. Name for Sahagin. I looked up the pronunciation. Oh, fuck. <laughs> All right. And yeah, right. would my would my character know what those are? Gross fish people. Yeah. History check and. Oh, history. Okay. Get above a ten because the, the name Sea Devil is fairly common. All right. Nope, I don't know what they are. You bonkers! I know everything that there is to know about Sahagwin. Or however you're supposed to pronounce it. Aha! Yes, but my mind is oh, better God. than yours. For in I don't fucking care. I know everything about them. Devils? I know. Sahajin. So, okay, so Hajin. So. I know that it's pronounced Sahajin. I know that uh, they ride sharks. I know they're gross fish people. I know that they're gross fish people. Yes. I guess right. we don't have them where I come from. All right, so we can go yeah, get our stuff now and fight these things, right? Yeah. As soon as I get my wand back, I'm summoning uh, my owl. I... Just to be clear. That, um, just actually give you some useful information. Alright. Okay. Oh shit, where's my horse? God damn it. Keeping <laughs> <laughs> my horse on this fucking boat, you better of you Where's monsters. my mule? Did you kidnap my horse as well? <laughs> I hope you did. Next room, you find all of your equipment, including all of the stuff that was in your room, because presumably you don't carry your saddlebags on your horse when it's stabled. Okay. But, uh... These fine sailors went through your uh, went through your rooms before taking you on board. So I grab my staff. Any of your... oh, good. Do not find any of your pets, any of your mounts. Although the cereals. Yeah, you cut out. Is something happening with my owl? Is my is in the room. Oh, my owl's in the room? Perfect. Great. Let's go. I guess because it's a Gallinodal. class feature of yours and not, like, a, a pet. It's a familiar. Is that familiar? Yeah. Is that kind of more intelligent? Yeah. 
All right. Yeah. Uh, They're masters alone. I grab what appears just to be like a normal ass stick. It would almost be a quarter staff, almost, but not quite. And then uh, I find some nice anklets. So I slip those back on, and then uh, I go. Actually, your magic items are also not in this oh, room. All right. Well, are never you... mind about the anklets. Oh well. The hang what? On. <laughs> Sorry. How does how does that work for me though? Because my equipment is in my magic item. Presumably um, they oh, took it out and... Oh, crap. You can't find most of your equipment either. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, mean, I have right. a bow and arrow you could use and a lyre. You're a bard, right? Um, uh, your yeah. magic items are visibly fancy and expensive. Oh, oh my those guys God, they are stole you... them from us. Now we're going to have to... All right. So, hey, are, are they are 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 they in the room with us? Have they gone up above deck yet? Yeah, they they ran straight up to the top okay. deck. All right. So I look at everybody and I go, just to be perfectly clear, we're gonna fuck these guys up once we're done killing the Sahagwin, right? Uh, yeah. They took my cloak that lets me swim underwater, which would have been extremely yeah. fucking useful no, in this they situation. Took my, they took my anklets. Those are good. Yeah, uh, don't even care. Uh, honestly, uh, I'm I'm not even 100 percent sure that we should help them fight the Sahuagin. No, no, you know no. no it's a matter of survival, boat? dude. Well, yeah, I'm I don't just know saying maybe maybe we let them, steer. you know, uh, you know, wear each other down a little bit. Yeah, I, but what if I, the... I, I, I... listen? Mm -hmm. Okay, well, no, but had... any this for two. We to get captured. Use the room. Goes up the stairs. I'm you... Gonna... Why? I, I follow him. Whatever. Where's my cloak? I run up the stairs screaming. Yeah. With I'm, my well, anklets. I mean, I guess Aurelia is going to go up and basically say, you know, I'm not going to help you unless you give me my my bag back because it has all my equipment in it. it um... I, I still need to be um, on the knowledge checks. Oh. Oh, oh right. <laughs> no, what knowledge checks? That, the knowledge checks we took to Three. see if we knew everything about history Sorry, checks, then. technically. Five minutes ago when we were talking about history. Listen, it's been taking a little while for my brain to warm up. <laughs> <laughs> so the, the Sawajin are um, an aquatic really shark-like creatures. They live in the ocean, and um, they tend to live towards like the, the abyss, They're known to raid ships that uh, pass over their territory, or what they consider their territory. In particular, they have a deep enmity like... Uh, time they lived in the uh, surrounding the archipelago which is now Narathak of the mountain in their attempts to civilize the area are given or forgotten tendency to go crazy at, at the scent of blood they have the ability to control and tame sharks the captain said about that it's definitely true and you probably shouldn't go into the water because considering where you are how many sharks are in the water this sucks Sawajin on the on the for, <clears throat> the Sawajin at least um you know have to climb on board in order to attack the ship Right. All right. Also, they've been known to have um, with two sets of arms. Oh, yeah, that's right. The bigger asshole one. They have a shark god. Strong, uh, strong uh, tradition. 
as you managed to roll that 25. Yeah. I'm a fucking genius. I'm good at my job. Brain genius self. Also, my job involves a lot of retelling historical stories in the form of interpretive dance. Don't judge me. <laughs> hey, look, I'm into that. It's I start singing and my brain genius does things. All right, let's just kill these things and then kill these guys and get no, our shit back. No, we can't. Oh, we can't kill them yet because then we have to. I don't know how to work a ship. Do you? A I'm question. a quick study. <laughs> Just a just a quick like legal question: Is press ganging legal in the empire? <laughs> That's a great question. Yes. Oh, ah, damn! Shit. Uh, well, surely it can't be legal for random people to do it. It might be legal for the navy to do it if there is one. Yeah, but... of course, in the empire. But it doesn't. But for my own purposes, I that this is fine. Okay. Um, yeah, anyway, Aurelia is still going to go up and basically demand her her uh, her bag because all her stuff is in there. She's yeah, and I not... can't. That's a lie. But uh, she's she's basically going to tell them, you know, I'm I'm not helping unless you give it back. And I need my cloak back because it helps me with water. And Should I roll water. persuasion or? See if you can get my clock back. I'm going to say yes. I have the That's sinking good. feeling. I'm going to have to try to talk these guys into this. Um, also, when you uh, up deck, you see that there are a lot more sailors hanging around. Can I also try to persuade them to give me my extremely relevant magical cloak? In that, like, it allows me to do shit in water? Because it's a cloak of manta ray? I'm gonna do it anyways. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, I'm just arranging no. pogs at the moment. Yeah, that don't work. I'm gonna... That dog don't hunt, my friends. Hey! Actually, it, um... The fact that you bring up that it's um, specifically for good for water activities, um, you get advantage on your roll. Oh, I was going to try and help her and confer the same bonus, so never mind. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, but no, really. <laughs> if you want me to be able to do shit in water, I need cloak of manta ray. All right, and uh, the other uh, the other check was persuasion for the uh, for the bag. Uh, I believe so. Yeah. Uh, the, yeah. The other check was persuasion for my thing, for my bag. Well, the twenty will definitely do it. Okay. Can you please get my get bag my back? Okay. Cool. Can you please get my cloak back. It, uh, my look will not be complete. I've based my entire look around that cloak. It's like a rug. I'm going to the room that is my that, that, oh. that sounds amazing, but you know, I feel like maybe we can do that after. I'm going to try and roll okay, and awesome. get my shit back as well. So uh, I'm just going to be like, hey, uh, you know, I don't wear shoes, but those anklets are are pretty. Like, you guys important. have all your equipment. What is with this stupid vanity? I'm getting. I'm doing it because I literally have. Like, I literally need that for sneaking, so uh, I'm going to try and do... DC was lower than theirs are. Uh, Normal. Uh, 17, get me my anklets back. Yeah, uh, sure. All right, cool. So the... God damn it! <laughs> His quarters. Uh, fuck this. If I win, I want my fucking cloak back. We'll need to win. Yeah, well, I'm gonna... He's back out with a bag and a couple of anklets, and he just sort of chucks them at you. I catch them, and I put them on. 
um, surrounding the ship rather than on you guys. Unlike the trans be the sea devil situation. Yeah, I'm going to take a look at the situation myself. Hmm. I'm not going to look. I'm just going to get ready to fucking fight. Yep. I'm just getting my. I'm um, just so. going to get ready to fight as well. And I'm drawing my crossbow. I'll need to do a little math here. Let's see. We can actually begin. Do we get pogs or? You import them yourself. I did not get. Uh, any can we import them? Stuff. I don't import them? think we, yeah, we can. cannot import them. Oh, it's yeah. fine. It does not I'm matter. Not because I can upload stuff. Yeah, I think the GM's the only one that can upload stuff. Um, yeah, they can upload objects, that is. Like, other stuff, we can upload on pictures, but... Yeah, literally just these cool kid. <laughs> Not even a joke. <laughs> yeah, you can just use my portrait that I put there. Just give me a generic token that sort of doesn't... Oh, wait. These guys. Ah! Hang on. Dang you, Did that work? <laughs> Do that. Do that. It's very large. Yes, it is very large. Hang on. Can you shrink it? Uh, you... I'm, I don't know. I clicked my picture in the bio thing, and then I'm I'm trying to figure out how to shrink it. It's not giving me an obvious way to shrink it. Unfortunately. Whoa, oh, there whoa. we go. How how'd you do that? I don't. I I clicked and dragged it from the the bio and oh info. Oh my god! Cool. Cool kid lives. Okay, can I shrink this though? I think Bob no. and can. Yep, Bob and can. I'll just wait. I love cool kid. Mhm. Mm very good. What the hell? Cool kid's very good. Come on, cool kid. For a second. There we go. Okay. I'm gonna uh, hold start on. I'm programming making, my. I'm making a pog real quick. So just. I'll put my shit into my shit. <laughs> Interesting. So. Yeah. Well, anyone, my character's name. The only way you can refer to me is as a cool kid. Uh, how do you do that? Uh, you so to upload your picture, go to um your. And then there's a um. Go, go to my. Let me go. Put out there. Go to my what? Go, go to your journal entry. Okay. So where it says Lake. Yeah. Uh, go to bio and info. The first tab. Okay. And then there's a button that says edit up at the right. Oh, okay. Yep. There I see. And then it. once you have your picture uploaded, um, you save your thing, go back to your bio and info and grab your picture with your mouse and then just drag it. Whoops. Hold on. Can I? That, that was not intentional. Yes, I can delete it. Then you just drag it. Uh, I'm cool just kid. trying to work out how to size it now. Uh, Bobbin's got to size it, so stop moving okay. it. There you go. It's been sized. Okay. I'm a cool kid. Everyone has like really serious pictures. Listen. This is something <laughs> I. Cool this is kid. not something I drew. I will end up drawing something that looks a lot less serious. Cool kid. Uh, can I? I can tie this right, to. I better get my fucking cloak back. Oh, I. I can't, yeah, I can't tie it to my character, so I just have to punch that. Well, you, you, you know where your cloak probably is. Yeah. And to his private quarters. And came out with two magic items. Well, when the fighting gets started, I'm probably gonna, you know, go in there you and leave it get to my me. Shit. I can go in there. 
get it for I'm gonna give you a significant look. <laughs> what? Like, yeah. So the, the three crewmen who are overlapping the uh, masts are actually up on the rigging. Aside from that, I believe all the crew should be visible, so give me that perception check you were going to give me. Alrighty. I'm not looking anywhere. All of us, or? I refuse to be perceptive. Oh, well. Alright, let me uh, roll something quietly. Okay, that means just... Let me roll my perception. Um... If I can see how to do that. That's the eyeball. Eyeball. Roll that eyeball. Roll that beautiful bean footage. You're doing better than me. <laughs> how do you roll without... Letting other people see it. Um, you could also. This is how I do it usually. Um, you know, Heave's robot friend that he made, Heave bot. If you message him, you can have him roll dice secretly. So you know what else I can do? Mm. Roll in real roll life. Roll a physical dice. Use any number of online dice rollers. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus oh, that's a good, that's a good goblin. I like that goblin. Oh, uh, uh, thank God. <laughs> no, that's troll. That is a pretty good drink it's a troll. Yeah, but none of them are as cool as my kids. So. No, none of them are. <laughs> my kid. Shrink the... No, the goblin just got to shrink the, got to shrink it. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Bobbin. Somewhere. Um, I'm a cool kid. Someone to it, and they weren't doing that earlier. What was that? Mm, not uh, me. Might have been me by accident. I don't know. <laughs> it's dark. Right. Oh. oh. He, uh, is only a crescent foaming from a steady wind. But the husband Terribly, that you still see it swarming up the side. You see what swarming up the side? On which side? A bonus round. What? Bonus round, what? Hey, you're, oh, there we go. You're cutting out really badly right now. Yeah. Like. <laughs> hmm. Initiative. Oh boy. Cool. Good. Well, that's a that's a thing I'm certainly good at. Don't believe. I didn't sign up oh, to great. fight stuff in Dungeons and Dragons. What? Where's my fucking initiative score? Oh, here we go. Didn't mind purse. Uh, we need. We don't have a turn tracker or yeah, like a token. Turn, turn orders. Yeah. Up. No. Bobbin's got the yeah. Adam. Bob's got to add them. Uh, I have them? No. Alright. That's fine. Oh, I got a really good initiative score! Wowee! That's mine. Right. I mean, considering I don't that. have a I can't, bonus I can't see mine. to initiative, I think I did um, alright. Um, you yeah, have, else, yours has yours not rolled this. Come through yet. Okay, well, that's... God, a cool kid is extremely... Uh, abilities? There we Actually, go. There it is. Seven. There, oh. there we go. <laughs> that's <laughs> unlikely. That's yeah, not that's fair. Unfortunate, but on the other hand, uh, 
my character does have a good role playing reason, which is that she's been putting on her stupid armor because <laughs> she had less time to do it than you guys. I don't wear armor. <laughs> yeah, well, I wear uh, studded armor, leather oh, armor, oh, which is comfortable quick, to sleep well, in. Every, well, these idiots were putting on their bullshit. Can I have cast major armor on myself? I cast, ma I cast mage armor on myself. <laughs> These dumb fucks were putting their armor on. Is this possible? I mean, mage armor is basically like is it a normal action. That should, yeah, that should be a lot less time than putting on armor. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, I'm, I'm, I'm going to cast it then. On myself while you guys are putting your, uh, what should we call it on your and, armor? Yeah, you know what? Uh, I'm going to cast. I'm going to use actually one of my spell slots for the day. So um, that's one of my so, spell slots. Uh, I'm going to use that. I'm going to cast. What was that spell called? It's probably written on my sheet somewhere. I know what I like. I know what it does, but I just don't know the name of it. Um, uh, magic art. Um, it's called uh, Armor of Agathis, and basically, I get since I'm casting it at level two because I that's just how I roll. Uh, I get ten uh -huh. temporary hit points, and um, and if something attacks me, they take ten cold damage. Dumb. Let me show you how to do real armor on my turn when it's my turn. So basically, a um, a over my armor, just like it starts frosting over. There we go. Here, I am going to rule that the uh will go before the supporting cast. Okay. Cool. Here's to be the goblin's turn. Okay. Hey, well, there what are was... two? There are two Sahujin coming up the side of the ship, stabbing, or will be shortly enough to be one round with a melee weapon. Right, I need uh, to. Uh try to attack him with my dagger. Now, since you are an assassin and you are going before them, you get automatic advantage on this attack. Nice. Whoa. Nice. Okay, so I can do that. Okay. How long does this armor look? Yep. Fifteen hits. Roll damage and add your sneak attack dice. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Oh, I'm next. Shit. Okay. I oh. should. Oh, just pass. while I have the. Sorry, hit let points. me just check my. Okay. Sneak attack dices again. Hey, okay. sorry. Uh, I need so to. The spell itself lasts an hour, but uh, it it disappears if all my temporary hit points go away. Sorry, just give me one second. So just, um, do you know how to roll just regular dice using the, the chat window? I forgot what the, um, slash roll. roll. You can find your, how much damage you're, what are you using? What weapon? I'm, trying to remember, I'm just, just trying to find what my, is. Your... You're in combat. Uh, ch -ch -ch -ch. Hit 1d4 plus 4 piercing. 
Add two d six because you are a third level rogue. Nice, bitch. Oh, Jesus. Okay. And that's a Oof. terrible roll too. Oofa yeah. doofa, buddy. <laughs> I guess. All right. All right. Is it my turn? You don't kill him. But you do stab him right in the shoulder. It hangs by the other arm and looks looks daggers at you. Mm. Oh boy. You give nothing away. You use All a right. bonus action. All right, so it's That's my turn, right? Uh, I'm going to use my bonus action to start Blade Song because it says use a bonus action to activate Blade Song. Lasts for a minute, so I believe that's like ten rounds. Of yeah, combat. That's, that's ten rounds. So it'll probably be done with this before that happens. Yeah. So then, it's like, uh, it's like rage. It's so something to do right when combat begins. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So then I'm going to. I also have ten extra feet of movement. So I'm just going to can I scoot on in here. Just scoot right in here. And I'm going to use a green flame blade, which requires me to make a melee attack. I'm going to do it against this guy. So. All right. So then I do that. So that does <laughs> Jesus fuck me. Well, uh, <laughs> cool. Uh, so does that yeah. hit? That hits? You Wait, hit. oh, okay. So then, um, all right, so. Okay, sorry, I was adding hit points to everybody. Okay. So I hit, and I'm hitting this guy here. So then, Injured that is, okay. Yeah, so then seven damage, and then a green flame jumps off my blade and hits this guy for four damage. For fire damage, I believe. Because it's okay. flame blade. And then that's my turn. I'm also still singing. <laughs> and waving my wand around. <laughs> oh, boy. Cool. All right. Now it's the Sahujan's turn. Oh, I kind of want them to hit me just so that way I can laugh in their face. Oh, there's a, there's other ones on the other side of the boat. Yeah. Whoopsie. Yeah. Whoopsie dipsy. Well, yep. eh, did not notice them. <laughs> it's okay. It's fine. Like I said, I kind of want them to hit me because... Two out of five have gone, yeah. Otherwise, I would have brought my 19 AC ass over there. <laughs> it's fine. I've got a 12 AC, but I've also got they oh, they fucking get hurt if they <laughs> attack me. So I'm also yeah. working with 34 hit points right now, so that's that's pretty cool. The top It'll be fun uh, when we get to your turn. Attacks the goblin that attacked it. Will be. Here. Oh, <laughs> Jesus. Jesus. Mm. Hmm. Well, bye. Deal. Oh, that well, was. I hardly knew the D and D was fun, guys. Right? <laughs> <laughs> you take seven damage. Uh, um, finds a weak spot in your armor and sinks deep. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> How you doing, buddy? Fifteen hits your armor class. Uh, plus sixteen. All right. Um, 
spear by uh, trumping at your face, but you, uh... The second one is going to go after Cool Kid. What up, bruh? Are you <laughs> fucking what? Oh, wow. kidding me? Like I said, that was a good game of TP, guys. It's a shame shit. that we had a TPK in the first session, but... Well, no, I'm probably not gonna die, but yeah, okay, yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm fine. Uh, I mean, at least... Is that the best you Whoa. have, Dave? <laughs> <laughs> At least they kind of wasted <laughs> their uh, their potential there. Oh my goodness! Uh, that is something. Nat went to, <laughs> to hit, and then Nat ones. For yeah, damage. suck it's it. On the damage roll. I'm so beautiful. It's not even funny. My voice is great. <laughs> it's. It looks like it's about to head straight for your heart, but uh, the mage armor surrounding you deflects it onto your sh onto your shoulder. Nice. Suck it. Except I say it in beautiful elvish song. I say suck it in suck beautiful it. elvish song. Well, no. I, I you, appreciate but you it. simply slap it across the face. <laughs> <laughs> cool kid. On the other side of the uh, ship. Oh, boy. Here we go. Here bad we go. AC party. That is... Goes after one of the regular crew. Oh, good. <laughs> I hey, these dice are loaded, motherfuckers! <laughs> wow, Bobbin, you're cheating. I know you are. <laughs> you're using weighted digital dice right now. I was a player Unpossible. right now and could make use of all these twenties. <laughs> again. Wow. <laughs> Seems unlikely. <laughs> this is impossible. <laughs> you, you, you could swear the guy got stabbed right in the heart, but actually went into his armpit and scraped his arm. <laughs> oh Jesus Christ! <laughs> oh, it's like when you're it's like when you're play sword fighting, and like the guy stabs him, you like you hold it in your arm to look at he got stabbed. That's exactly what happened. Actually, should have rolled that on uh, D fours because that was his bite attack that went second. Ah, uh, well. The way. last one manages to get all the way on board the ship. Come on, come on, try uh, me, motherfucker! Flying there. Yep. Come on, motherfucker, try me. I should check out what my other spells are. And that's your twenty. The, no, the eighteen surprise. hits. The eighteen hits. Okay. You, uh, you managed to parry its spear. Then it bites me. In... Okay. Well, um, I it bites, lose it bites one you for ten... two damage. Uh, it takes ten cold damage. I thought it leveled up um, later. Nope. Maybe. Nope, at higher levels, you can, um, oh, oh no, hold on, Armor, let me take a look. Either way, it's going to be taking cold damage, um, but, uh, let me take a look at the spell. Armor of Agathis? Yeah. Armor of yeah, Agathis. you cast it at, at yep. second yep. level. at second yeah, level or so. higher, and I, it, it all my spells are automatically, automatically, yep. So, it takes ten cold damage. Okay. Um, lost two temporary hit points. Oh, I lost armor is stent is okay. My two temporary hit points. All right. Okay. So basically, as yeah, it um... basically as it bites me, it like it like it just it's like biting into dry ice. So like you can see his like mouth just smoking for a little bit. <laughs> Side and it gets a spear ready. You slap it aside and then just motion with the other hand. Come at me, bro. Yes. And it comes at you. It tries to bite bite you, but when it gr but when it sinks its teeth into your arm, a shock of cold energy just blasts it, staggers it back. 
deal significant amounts of damage. Try me, motherfucker! Yeah. Dare you! <laughs> Alright, that is oh it for that turn. Alright, so, um... Here's the thing. Uh, my character... Like, this, is, this isn't even a spell. Just... Feathery yes. wings of light just appear from their back. And he and they just start flying up. I know this provokes an attack of opportunity. If it wants to take it, it can... It's not... Turn yet. Oh, it's not... Oh, oh. Oh, okay. It's up here, nice and quick. This out. Oh, it's more of these assholes. Got it. God damn it. Um, where are they? Make a wisdom saving throw. Who? Who? Nako. Okay. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Yeah. Need a wisdom saving. Make a throw. wisdom saving throw. Wisdom, wisdom. Hey, don't go insane. See, so we're a demon. You feel energy come over your limbs. Focus. Mm. Your fingers, and you successfully force it away. Oh, fucking good! Fly Mickey's turn. All right. So again, uh, feathery wings made of light. Uh, it just start, and they just start flying up. Uh, he's. They are not doing a um, th that thing that lets them uh, not provoke an attack of opportunity by moving. The. So uh, the fish man Yay. is welcome to try and attack me if he wants to eat another 10 points of cold damage. <laughs> oh, okay. Nice. Well, go ahead and roll damage. Holy shit. Is Some good wrong 20s. The dice today. Uh, I'm going, well, I'm going to predict a 1, us. 1, and plus 1. No, he's going to definitely roll full damage. What are you talking six, about? Six. <laughs> Then you're just gonna die. <laughs> tonight than I have ever rolled in my like entire career <laughs> until this point. Okay, well that eats up the rest of my temporary hit points. Um, I still got all my normal hit points, so the so the ice armor just disappears. But it takes another ten points of cold damage. Why is he? S is this thing dead yet? Stop! Stop biting. I had the wrong cursor type. Um, it is only barely hanging in there. All right, so I fly up thirty feet because that's the most the flight the uh, the flying speed allows, and then uh, I lift my staff up and I cast Eldritch Blast on it because fuck you. Now I'm flying and there's nothing you can do about it. It has a range of three hundred feet. Uh, so that's plus that would be six. Hold on, I I should have just okay. So magic. Uh, there we go. Yep, six. Nothing. That's it's twelve damage. Hit. All right. Um, it deals one d ten force damage. So it takes nine damage. I'm pretty sure I just killed that thing. Uh, you use your middle finger to fire <laughs> an Eldritch Blast. <laughs> right. Right at the Sahujan. <laughs> These guys are having um, a bad day. They should run away. Knocks it right off the ship. Do it sharks get... Sharks eat it? 
water does start foaming around uh, where it fell in. Nice. Either sharks are eating it, or its own people are Live eating it. Either way, it's getting eaten. Shark. So, uh, yeah, um, nice. I believe that's my move. I don't think I could do anything as... Wait, hold on, is that thing... Just a bonus, and you used a regular action. No, I used, I used a bonus to... Yeah, I used a bonus to form the wings, I used a move to fly, and then I used a uh, regular action to shoot. So that's my turn. All right. Half work. All right. Well, Do some damage. Nothing, yeah, I'm not seeing any room to fit in on the left hand side. So I. Yeah, we gonna, got this. Yeah, I'm gonna slip in underneath the the flying guy after giving a thumbs up of good job, and <laughs> go beat up that Sahagin. I'm gonna start with my spear. Alright, that'll do. Okay. Know for sure now that a 12 will hit them. Uh, mm -hmm. No need to ask me. I don't uh, know how to denote how high. damage. And then I'll take a bonus action to just punch it in the face. <laughs> Very elegant. I like it. It's, it's the monkish way. Yes. No. Indeed. I approve. I'm 22. I'm Jeez. Holy, holy crap. Hit. Okay. You can bleed. And a seven. I successfully punch it in the face. And that's my turn. <laughs> You really pummeled that poor thing. Falls wow. off the side. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. That is the half elf. Mm -hmm. um, Aurelia is going to recite a poem she's composed just for this occasion. <laughs> It's not really the time for poetry. It, this exact occasion once... that you being uh, kidnapped and attacked by fishmen? Yes, well, specifically the attack by fishmen part. <laughs> okay. Wow. It goes Coming a little something like this. Different. There once was a dumb Sahuagin. His face was as ugly as sin. He climbed up our boat, but tonight we will gloat as we dine on the soup of his fin. <laughs> um, I'm not, not eating a fishman. It's, it's, it's dining metaphorically. Um, yeah, no, I've eaten worse. Use vicious mockery on... Oh, you uh, have that too! <laughs> You have vicious mockery. Yeah, and trip it gets around. Um, I thought it was more of a bard thing, but uh, anyway, at, uh, I have a, I have a. Uh, I'll use, I'll feature. use that on the Sahuagin that's uh next to the Gabo. Uh, I have a class feature that allows me to choose. You get a little the... circle up here. Yeah, this one. Uh, I, I just want to explain to Visk real quick. I have a class feature that lets me choose cantrips from any class, so I chose Vicious Mockery as one of them. Mm, okay. Um, will against? Is that just will? Uh, yeah, it's or it's. It's, it's a wisdom, wisdom saving throw. Yeah. Save. Twenty. Natural. Thanks. Knowing how Bobbin's been rolling this entire game. Oh, Mine is works. completely fortified. Okay. And then it will get uh, so it takes one disadvantage on its next attack. Yep. You basically yeah. make fun of it so hard that it doesn't believe in itself anymore. Mm -hmm. On creatures that don't understand That's you. Four damage too. Mean joke. Poor psychic damage. Yeah, yep. it's such a it's such an it's such a sick burn that it uh, transcends language barriers. It's advantage, we'll say. He's disheartened. Time for the crew to finally do something. I see here because I didn't start them out. For what it's worth, I'm specifically not using any of my you know, real spells, because I want to save those to 
if we have to fight the crew. Fair enough. I mean, I've got one more spell slot left for the day. I only get two. The wings don't count. Although I can also only use those once a day. Hope they kill some people and earn their keep. Yeah, they should get advantage on their attack rolls for a home field advantage. Of course, this should not no. this, this should not apply when they fight us. Uh, they should get disadvantage because we're so awesome. Actually, um, the captain guys actually landed a blow into the back of the uh, southwestern Sahuajin. Nice. Uh, the the guy in the bottom right here threw an axe and nailed it right there in the uh, back. Back left bum cheek. Although I will uh, say this, cat that one uh, spell slot. Did it hold its weight? Uh, uh, you kill the thing with a with a cantrip. That's pretty good. No, no. Well, that's not the um the armor isn't a cantrip. The armor is the level one spell slot. I I'm two. saying that because of all oh. the damage it does. Oh yeah, yeah. You could finish it off with a cantrip. Yeah. To be fair, Eldritch Blast gets really good if you invest in it. So. Mm -hmm. and I'd like to swing my dagger at the uh, I've been fighting should I roll with a badge just because, because it's been like days by the poem or whatever no it, that's on its roll it has disadvantage oh sorry excuse me and sadly the uh, you is using a ranged weapon so he does not count as a uh, in terms of uh, sneak attack, but okay, so I'm kind of looking pretty bad. You could probably finish it off regardless. Let's see. Okay, that's pretty good. I assume. I guess I hit that. Yep. Plus four. Seven damage. Yeah. You um. Your dagger cracks right through its skull under the water that starts foaming immediately. Cool. Yeah, Just these things are eating each other because they're just that blood craze. That's awesome. I'll be sure to put this into my report. Your report? What Bonus. the? <laughs> Allowed. I'd like to... Um... You've got bonus actions. you got um, move. Um, my bonus... Move to hide. Mm -hmm. Climb up the the ramparts or whatever. I want to go up to the quarter decks. Um, I want to hide. I want to do the hide action, and moving around would be part of the. But like, yeah. You, I, yeah so move. you roll hide or sneak or whatever okay. it's called now. So you are here then, or are you actively behind the door on the next deck down? Let's do the latter. I'm I'm going beneath deck. Okay. okay hide. So I assume that means like sneak or whatever. So you hard and hide behind the door. Oh, okay. They are probably not going to notice you. Uh, I they are actually not. perceptive. Like three, yeah, but they would have to spend their action. Yeah, it's on their turn that they... It, and it spends an action. Yeah. So Specifically because I play a rogue in another thing. Uh, they have to spend their action on their turn trying to spot him if they care. And then once one of them spots... Him, they can yell, he over there. I'm just a little goblin 
No. Oh, it's still maybe I find a barrel. Maybe I find a barrel to. Like I said, you're just hiding behind the door frame at this point. Yep. Sorry. Uh, and that's the end of my turn. It's my wound. All right. wound. I kind of like poke at it a little it's bit. It's cool kid, cool. sir. Cool kid gonna fuck some shit up with, uh, well, let me take a look here. What do I want to do? <laughs> Guess I'll just attack this dude with a blade. Is there anyone coming up this side of the thing? I think just the one Over that here? you're dealing with. Yeah, just that one. Okay, cool. I'm just gonna hit him with my sword. What that I'm good at. Actually, nope, I lied. Can I step back a little bit? And does he well, get an in my range, it would get an opportunity on you. I will I will take that risk to step back. Because I got a plan. Natural twenty. Well you Yeah, well fuck. You can cast spells in melee that yeah, uh, I could do that, but uh, there is. Uh, hold on, let me take a look here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, I'm not gonna. Eleven armor class, so. Yeah. Okay. Well, I realized that the thing that I was gonna do wouldn't do more damage than another thing I could do, so I'm just gonna hit him with a stupid sword. Uh, 13 hits, so that is 1d8 plus 4. Okay, 6 damage. God damn it. Die. In there. Die. I whine. By the way, I, I just looked up the rules for hiding, and the big thing is that it needs to beat the passive perception. Oh. Mm, there you go. Then it takes them an action to look for you. I'm pretty oh, sure see. these guys don't have a 21 passive perception, though. Unless we're yeah, looking at, like, a 40 uh, wisdom, in which case I'm more scared. Than if you had rolled a 5, then it would have just watched you um, as you clumsily stick your ass out next to the door. <laughs> so we're all, all clear on how that goes. Yep. And so the rapier attack, was that it? Yep, that's it. All right, it's their turn now. These assholes. Um, going first. Dean, hit your armor class. Cool kid. Uh, hold on, sorry. It doesn't. Uh, no, my armor class is 19 while I'm singing. Oh, while you're singing? I was like, what the f***? And no. Yeah, and also mage armored up. Yeah. So, no. Yeah, that makes sense. All right. Are too fabulous for it to connect. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. He doesn't want to stop my beautiful singing. As long as I don't use a two-handed weapon, I'll be good. This one just sort of adjusts down the side of the, uh, the railing. That's the, uh, the, the half-orc monk that just... <laughs> monk. Nope. I'm pretty sure it does not. Nope. Is, um... Oh, who among you are, are in, is injured? Uh, Me. I am injured. I've lost three hit points because he got that twenty. I've lost seven hit points. I am still technically full because all it, they never got to my actual hit points. They only damaged my temporary. Oh boy! If it's a wisdom check, I gotta make. Not Here's the good. thing: it's ad advantage on wounded enemies. Ah, and well. Roll versus Cool Kid again. Jesus. Oops, fuck. Do it. Yeah, the 20 hits me. Go ahead and... How much damage do I take? 
oh, that's not that bad. <laughs> Especially since nah, most I of just, the time they will I just not have be able a, to hit me. I have a sneaking suspicion that they've got something bigger up their sleeves. Or yeah, fins well, uh... or horrible many rows of mouths wherever they hide well, listen, things. Listen, if we can kill them, we can drive the boat away faster. I guess. Oh, yep, there's some more. Yeah. Oh, no, they made it on. Where? 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 On the, on the uh, southern part of the quarter deck. Oh, those guys are fucked. Who yeah, gives those, a shit? those guys are fucking. They're dead. <laughs> I'll we'll be fine. I'll like, be I fine. don't know you guys, but uh, you guys are in the same boat as I am, literally, in that you got you were all kidnapped and were being forced to do this, so. Fuck them. I press gank. I'll, I'll save you guys before I save them. Injured. <laughs> Injured. Is moderately injured. Hmm. Oh, there's another one on the northern quarter deck. Well, okay. I'm not calling these boat names. Or views. My turn? Okay, um... No. Oh, oh yeah, that's right, the other um, thing. needs to make... Wisdom save. Who makes a wisdom save? Uh, the monk again. Oh. I need to make Goblin a wisdom save. Goblin made first save. Okay, where's wisdom, wisdom? There it is. Fifteen. You also feel a um, energy try and stiffen your limbs. Shake it off. Shake it. Okay, what was that? I mean, I wouldn't even know what he's talking about because it hasn't happened. Probably magic. Probably gonna say probably, it's magic. Yeah, probably magic. I know magic. There's no such thing as magic. You're literally <laughs> watching an angel fly above you shooting laser beams. Well, I sing a song that makes me invincible. No, I'm ignoring the angel. <laughs> also, you're a bard! <laughs> that is punchy shit. Alright. So, is, is that it? That thing? Your turn now. All right, I rise another 30 feet as my move action. Jesus Christ. Because my Eldritch Spear has a range of 300 feet, I can go as high as I damn well please. And I'm going to shoot uh, this one. You will need to um, sacrifice 10 lateral motion because you're not moving with oh. the ship anymore. Okay, yeah, that's fair. Uh, so I will, I, will ri I will rise 20 feet then. So I'm 50 feet in the air right now. Which I'm pretty sure they cannot throw spheres 50 feet, so I'm just gonna... But anyway, I'm gonna, uh, shoot that thing with an Eldritch Blast. Oh, uh, no. Nope. I oh, miss. Goodness. I'm just glad it's not on that one. <laughs> uh, and, uh, Maybe don't uh, be Unlike some stuff. DMs, I do not... Yet... Fail list. All right. Well, you just see the laser just sort of splash into the water behind it. I guess and that's my turn. Yep. Are there? Wait. Are there advan 
Is there rules for advantages for being like high above a character and then? Well, yes, you have the high ground, so therefore you. I think I. I think, <laughs> no, like I literally think that might be a rule. It's like if I'm on a higher elevation than they are, I get, I get advantage. I'll I'll look that up. You go to the next person. I think that's true. All right. Yeah, I kept that one. Okay. Well. I might as well finish what I started then. Yeah, beat him up. Yep. Yeah, get the damn thing another spear attack. Nineteen mm -hmm. definitely hit. And oh boy, that is seven damage. How's it looking? Lashes off. Foam. You know the drill. Nice. Alrighty. That you can move and then use your bonus attack for the unarmed. That's what I was just going to ask. Um, that's part of my movement. Can I jump onto the quarter deck here? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Um, if you're going to I'm jump to instead of use that. the stairs, I will make you roll... Athletics, okay. Thirteen. Um. Oh, uh, you, you rather ungracefully slam into the railing. Okay. Should I use the stairs, buddy? Just climbing, climbing over it like a ungraceful person would. Okay, yeah, they didn't, make it up there, they, they didn't keep that rule, however, uh, there there are penalties, you get disadvantage if you're, like, using ranged combat within five feet. The, nevertheless, you, the uh, distance you covered is short enough, difference, and um, get within range is your bonus attack. Okay, so as I leap up, I see the Sahaga in front of me, and I just... Bring my fist down on its skull. Or well, at least try to. Yeah, fuck him up. Do it. Twelve. That's a hit. Fuck him up. That's a hit? Yeah. Okay. Nice. How long does your flight last, Kalen? One minute. So I saw plenty of time. And that's okay. another six damage. Yeah, that's... What ten rounds? It's only been yeah, two. Yeah, it's only been two. Like I, I can. Here's your flight. Your flight's gonna fail when I fail. You get a serious bruise on your arm. Uh, uh, sea devil's arm. Uh... Hmm. You're up to the bard. Right. Kill this Joker. Should I do? Kill him. Kill him. Yeah, I'll just mock this stupid thing again. Uh, yeah. So yeah, I'm just gonna use the my uh vicious mockery on the uh, the other Sahuagin. Father was so ugly. A piranha is fourteen. Yep. So it won, and you do nothing. Wow. It was a pretty lame. lame. Get better lame. burns, yeah. I scream. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> See, this is what happens when you don't actually... Yeah, you need another poem. Yeah. You only That's had the one, one situation. You didn't have multiple poems for the same situation. That was your mistake. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm Fortunately, the uh, now about an annoying uh, warlock. <laughs> you don't know I'm a warlock. For all you know, uh, I'm just a go? heavenly I, savior. You're no, you're definitely not that. <laughs> you screamed Eldritch Blast, my dude, or whatever. <laughs> I didn't scream it. 
I just cast a middle finger. Uh, I just used my middle finger to shoot a laser out of it. That's all. The crewman with a crossbow actually just murdered the, the left hand. Cool. Oh, nice. So the captain climbs onto the uh, aft quarter deck. <laughs> Holy shit! One. And um, does he just straight up murder a Sahagin? No, I said it that way for so long here. that I cannot say it the the correct way. I'm sorry. Sahagin. Sahagin. Sea devil. Yeah, sea devil's hmm. easier. Devil yes, person, he did. please. He just straight up killed it. Cool. Sea Devil America. Good job, Sorry. Captain. Good God. Can you not do that so I can do my cool blade trick again? <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're, the, we're the protagonists here. Stop stealing all the cool moments. Or I have an actual real good plan, actually, now that I think about it. Okay, there's this plan has to work because it's so dumb. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I mean, that's the D&D &D way. I mean, honestly, we should just let these guys handle it. They seem to be pretty on top of things. No, I have a real good plan. Don't. I mean, it. I suggested that, and you guys didn't want to. So. Well, listen, I didn't know that they were, like... Competent? Competent at their jobs. Well, Come on. To yeah, be they fair, us. a really lucky hit in order to kill one. And aside from that, they've only just been doing... Um, Oh, anyway, yeah. Goblin's turn. I don't like the way... Uh, able to clamber out of my hind space and up to this target here and do a sneak attack on it within one turn. And even if it spots you, that doesn't matter because it is engaged with an enemy. Yeah. An enemy of it. All right. Condition it, it takes to use sneak attack. Oh, I forgot to roll my stupid Al's initiative, whatever. Whatever. I could have been having advantage on the literally... No, because Al's can help. They can use the help action and give you advantage. Yeah, but the, it can also be a target, is the, uh, is the give yeah. and take there. Yeah, yeah. But also... <laughs> What's your Al's <laughs> name? Uh, it's Gallon Nodal or something like that? It means Moon Whisper in Elvish. Nice. Jesus Christ. And Your again, that was... That's a... Uh, that's an alright-ish. Alright, I got what I would describe a real cool plan. I got a good roll just by stabbing someone and I didn't need to fly into the air and do a whole big laser show about it. <laughs> <laughs> He's... Uh, Lake is practicing for their, their their upcoming show, The Last Laser Master. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, so... Unless you want to disengage or something, that that would be your turn. Uh, yeah, that's my turn. Blade All right. Singer. So, all right. Here's what I need to do, Bob, and, and I need you to tell me some stuff. So, I would like to cast Lightning Lure. Uh, hold on. Let me lightning lure make sure i'm doing this right so uh but i want so the range is 15 feet i want to cast it straight up in the air and lure one of these suama women's on the quarter deck towards me out. call them sea devils sea devils i want to lure them towards me so if i shot it where would i need to be so that if i shot it straight up in the air they would get like here they'd get pulled towards me and then do a hilarious prat fall <laughs> off of the quarter deck and land right next to me. Where would I need to be to theoretically Complete make this happen? These do just sound effects. I love it. 
Yeah, so where would I have to move to, so I could shoot straight up in the air with my wand and do that? Because I think it would be funny. <laughs> Is the only in-character reason <laughs> I would do this. Well, um... Basically, I want to shoot it up like a flare, and then when it's in the air, it pulls, like, this guy. But it needs to be within 15 feet of me to do the pulling. So yeah, where well, would I need to be? The thing is, it's called a lightning lure, but it's actually more like a lightning whip that automatically pulls things towards you. Oh. Specifically you. Okay. So then I want to get up on the... Where? Okay. Is then that not a course spell? Plan. No. It's okay. on uh, Sword Coast Adventures, which is okay. also... How do I... Okay, here's my question. How do I stand on here and cast Lightning Lure and get both of these chumps <laughs> to come towards me? I'm thinking that's the mass. You probably can't. Uh, lame. Fine. I'm gonna go up you've here. Got, you've got the ruler tool. Yeah, okay. So it's, we're just doing... Uh, yeah, 15 feet is about here. About here. So... Uh, if I was standing here... Could I make that chump come towards me and fall off the quarter deck and it would be funny? Well, you, you could only um, basically pull it towards fine. Grunash. You, you would kind of make the two smack into each other. Oh, that would be great, actually. <laughs> Can I do that? Yeah. All right, I'm done for that. And then you hear the cool, boom. I'm going to. All right, so they need to make this guy here needs to make a strength check, and it needs to beat a DC of fourteen, I believe. Give me one second to check on that. Yeah, fourteen. So it needs to make a. God damn it! My good mm -hmm. trick. It would have looked really cool. I scream. <laughs> I believe you. <laughs> That's what no, I get sometimes it. Sometimes with the seven throws. I just check on my shoulder and I was like, what the hell was that? <laughs> it was a firework. Ignore it. I'm just going to try it again next turn. My turn's over. <sighs> See, it's really bit funny. Of, a bit of um, coherent lightning and, and stretch to the, towards the sea devil sort of stabs before it reaches his leg. Uh... Sort of a... Uh, I don't want to go up have there. Done. See, here's the thing, though. I don't want to walk up there like a pleb. It's got to be your cool. action, anyhow. Yeah. Well, god damn it. It would have been good. Well, I tried jumping up there and looked a bit of a fool, but, you know. Yeah, at least I didn't look dopey. At least I still look pretty cool. Yeah, you did not um, jump head... Or jump chest first into a railing. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. I was trying to click the ruler, and I clicked the wrong thing. You can get rid of that. D20 instead of the, uh, <laughs> with the modifiers. This gets very good. <laughs> yeah, like I said, uh, if Bobbin wants to get rid of that, he can. It was an accident. The thing. No, okay. It's very good, actually. And dies to the. Uh... Oh, no, not. Oh, someone died? Jerry? Craig and piss, nerd. Don't worry, I'm gonna do the same thing again. It's gonna be very cool. All right, move my character back now that it's lightning luring it to me. Wait, the two of them died? Eh, maybe. Listen, we gotta let him clear them out a bit. Oh, I meant two of the crew members. Yeah, Does anybody probably. need to make a Who cares? saving throw? Oh. 
is happening. Mm-hmm. I, I'm just waiting to see if somebody else needs to make a saving throw before I can take my turn. Yeah. <sighs> okay. And is okay. Dang it, that's wrong. Just the warlock armor class. Oh, um, my armor class is twelve, but I'm also like fifty feet in the air. Do do slight to you, just barely missing you. A, a what? On the left. A what? A shark. Oh, someone shot a out shark the, at you. That flashes out of the water. Oh, spot the thing that's been that threw it. So Hujin. Hmm. It's Dr. Shark Tosser. Hmm. Okay. All right. Do you want to have against this thing? Uh... Try lightning glue our ice cream. Your turn, so. Um. Oh shit! That's a dude. I see. This dude. I'd actually have to. I'd actually have to fly down me. in order to use the spell, Dark and I don't want to do face. that. Uh, uh, makes you feel any better? You're still in range of it. Yeah. Oh well, I'm gonna rise up another twenty feet. <laughs> I'm just gonna keep flying. You're not gonna be. And then you're gonna fall, and it's gonna be real fucking funny, my I dude. I will start descending before I know how long this lasts. I'm on round three of ten. I'm fine. Um, I'm gonna r- rise another. Th- 20 feet and move another 10 feet with the boat. Actually, you know what? No, I'm going to... I'm not going to move with the boat. I'm just going to move that way. I'm just going to straight up rise in another 30 feet. And then, uh... And so then... That's a total of 70 feet. No, it was a, to- it was a total of 80 feet because I was 50 before. Oh, right. The first movement yep. Yep, uh, the was first... also 30. Yep. Um... So I'm just, I'm just gonna move thirty feet thirty feet straight up because god damn it I don't want to get hit by a spear and have advantage on have these things have advantage on me and I'm gonna blast this new fucker that showed up with the eldritch blast the spear of course cool. because that's basically all I can do from when I'm this high up. We had a cool plan. Uh, I probably misses it. This is. Yeah. Well, this thing's AC is probably pretty beefy. Yeah, and unfortunately, <laughs> I'm just rolling really crap with my attack spells. Um, so, um, there's uh, yep, yeah, that's on the uh, aft quarter deck. Don't move! I scream. There's a really funny joke I'm gonna do. <laughs> Yep, yeah, alright. It's probably Sorry, gonna fucking open one for pranks. God damn it. But it would be really funny. I move around this way, from the side, in place of the uh, dead, uh, dead crew member, and just lash forwards at the Sahagin with my weapons. So starting off with a spear. Oh, oh nice. nice. Roll every damage die twice. Yep, and I also get a plus one die of damage on the critical savage attacks. So... so roll three. Um, Holy moly. So that's 3d6. Am I reading that right? Got another damage die button around there somewhere, yeah. Okay, uh, so 3d6 plus 
for Yowza. You're definitely gonna kill him. Okay, so that cool. poor, poor yeah, he just person ripped his arm off dead. and beat him to death with it. Yeah. Is it still alive? I have a bonus attack. Oh, okay, I still have to beat it. Okay, well I'm gonna punch it in the face to make sure it's dead. Jesus fucking. Just about. Okay. And with its hit points, uh, the trouble because your bonus would kill it. Yep. So I just smack you... it in the face and just break it. Behind the uh, the ship's wheel, and your spear firmly into the midsection. Um, it looks up at you, it growls, and as it opens its mouth, you shove your fist through it. Jesus Christ. That's awesome. As this gasp is last breath, I pull it towards me as a free action and just go, I guess it's fish soup tonight. Mm -hmm. Gross, what is it with everyone wanting to you eat? You stole my joke. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, these things are sentient. I probably would not want to eat them. That's sort of... Oh, is that a challenge? I'm going to start eating one. <laughs> <laughs> now you're into it. <laughs> That's kind of Bard. cannibalism to eat a sentient being. We've got a severely wounded Zahujan on the... Uh... Four quarter deck, but it's severely wounded. And then you've got this thing that's been throwing spells. Yeah, yeah I'm gonna we, fuck that shit up. Can we please fuck up the spell slinger? Off the Get over on my turn. Uh, Lightning Ruru was a clever ruse. A <laughs> bad idea to use it against that thing and oh. on board. It's my turn. Okay, well... This thing does kind of seem like a threat. But I'm still not going to use any of my real spells. I'm going to use a real spell. Or maybe... Ah. Hmm. I Please use a real spell. Okay, wait. I, is... I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to turn to uh, the, the, the wizard fighter elf... What up? Cool kid. How 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 smart are these things? Fairly smart. Smart? Yeah, I think they have a language. I mean, I would know in character if they had a language, but I, out of character, don't know that. Uh, yeah, they're they're uh, fairly intelligent. They are, yeah. They have a god. They are, by all so. indications, at least intelligent as any surface dwelling humanoids. Mm, okay. Well, I guess I should use a real spell. <laughs> Good God. I think it was oh. dependent on intelligence if he should use the real spell or not. I mean, not quite, but I've, I've got a couple options just thinking about which one I want to do. Uh... Well, that's right. I'm gonna try using uh, dissonant whispers on this thing. Ah, uh, careless whispers. Although my favorite song. Mm, that that would be better if it were engaged with someone, but I guess it's not going to be. So, uh, yeah, but it's some guaranteed damage. Okay, yeah, I'll do it. So it's a wisdom save. Um. Mm -hmm. Wisdom, but yeah, wisdom. Oh, something happens. Okay, so I do nine psychic damage, and it runs away. <laughs> That's even better than what, what I was. That was even better what I was going to do, which was 
going to get 30 feet within it, cast suggestion and, tell, and suggest that it might want to just leave. So, yeah, I, uh, it takes 3d6 psychic damage and must immediately use its reaction if to move as far as its speed allows away from you. God damn it. <laughs> nice. Okay. Well, I didn't I'm have to done. pull out my guns. Straight down. Oh, good God. Experience. Cool. Well, we won. Good job, everyone. <laughs> yeah, good job. Wow, when I'm you started playing that this whispers. Uh, injured enough and completely surrounded by all the crew. This turn. It does not survive long enough to take its next turn. <laughs> all right. I sort of float down and but no longer flying. I mean, technically, it only has to run away for, like, you know. Around the moment, well, it could come back immediately, but well, I, I don't know. In that case, well, if it comes, kind of died. If yeah, well, either way, it, I'm going to prepare an action. If it does come back, I'm going to just cast it. I'm going to cast suggestion. But if it doesn't come, if back, it does I'm, come back, I want to prepare an action. You take all the same spells. As well, um, make a witch bolt. Also, does suggestion work on things that you're fighting? Uh, as long as I you guess. don't attack them again. I was just going. I was just going to to suggest that it go home and uh and never bother the ship again. Yeah, I suppose. A charm person, um, gets advantage on the saving throw if you're attacking them. Okay. Besides yeah. that, most enchantments don't have you know. Cool. Aren't yeah. harder if you're in combat. Where's the captain? He's up there. Yo. He's he's up there. Caps. I I know where everybody is on this boat because I was hovering above it for a Actually, good fuck this. quarter where's, of a minute. Where's the captain's quarters? I'm getting my fucking cloak back. They're in here. It's in here. It's in, yeah, it's in there you go. You're welcome. Um, well, I I actually in that vein, I was gonna go talk to the captain and uh, cast suggestion. <laughs> 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 I mean, I also have charm person, so um, we just want to like. Yeah, but charm person, uh, once it expires, it pisses them off, doesn't it? No, that's they friendship. That you charm them. Yeah, with that's... charm person, they know what you did. Yeah, with suggestion, they don't know what you did. Because so... I rolled a three. Um. Yeah. Okay. So I'm gonna say to him, well, you know what? Look, we just saved your lives. Um. But I do have Keep to try it to make one a... or two sentences. Okay, given that we just saved your lives, <laughs> and given that you still need our help, I think the best course of action for all parties involved would be for us to sign a contract right now where you pay us the, you know, a fair rate for our services, give us back all our magic items, and compensate me for my horse, <laughs> and then we'll continue helping you till you get to your destination. I'm specifically going to have him drop and sign a contract so that even when the spell expires, I'll have it to hold over him. Cool. I'm rummaging through his shit to find <laughs> As I'm doing it, I'm screaming, it ties the whole outfit together! <laughs> Alright, well, I'm not going to have you roll investigate because they just sort of dropped it on the... Fucking good. Put it on my body. All of your magic items are just sitting right there. When she comes out, uh, I'm like, whoa, that does tie the whole outfit together. Yeah, I know, right? I'm going to just show everyone. (laughs) Do you see what I'm saying? You can't just... Doesn't the outfit doesn't work without the cloak? I'm not picking up anyone. I move over to investigate what's going on. She looks amazing. Look at her. Don't you like my cloak? Uh Uh-oh. It really does tie the outfit together. We We lost the DM. Cool. I'm Whoa. gonna point everyone that cares oh, okay. that their shit's in this room, and that if they also want to tie their outfits together, then they should. <laughs> uh, my outfit okay. is always tied together. Disagree, but okay. That rude. <laughs> Listen, I. You know what just happened? I accidentally just closed my browser. Oh. I am back. Okay. You were so uh, shocked. We we, we were just there. getting our magic items back. Those. Well, not. Yeah. Uh, 
I'm putting. I'm telling other people they're in there, but I'm not actively gonna go pick them up. And uh, if this motherfucker tries to uh, touch my cloak, I'm going to uh, jump in the water and swim away <laughs> like a manta ray. No, no, I'm not gonna touch it. I'm just. I wanted. Like not li- you. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. I was about to say. All right. Um, I was. I don't care about you. No, like I, I genuinely like. I'm interested in your fashion tips. That don't involve oh, okay, shoes. Then I miss... That don't involve I'm... shoes. Fine. Well, not everyone can be as perfect as me. <laughs> the uh, the captain is going to follow your suggestion. Contract of um, escort the ship. But uh, he's going to quibble on one point because he is not aware that you have any mounts. <laughs> Check the ownership of any of the horses in any of the stables connected to the inns. Wouldn't we have I, I had, had like some horse. paperwork to stake I that? had a riding horse. It's worth 75 gold. I require compensation. Or the horseback. I mean, if you can find the horse for me, that would be fine, too. Either way. But look, you kidnapped me, but you neglected to kidnap my horse. Where's my pet mouse, motherfucker? I mean, I can prove I had a horse. Let let me just pull out the ten pounds of horse food that I have in my fucking bag. (laughs) Unless you think I was carrying these around for fun. I'll just give you 75 gold, Where is Bastion? I demand Bastion back. Give me Bastion. I'll just give you an owl. Stop. Chill out. No. Don't need a mouse. I don't. No. I do need a mouse. I'll He's buy my friend. You a new one when this we get not, to shore. Not, not the same. Well, you don't know till you try. I kind of well, do. Thing is that uh, mm, the uh, like... the trip from Narathak down to Okar and a half. Our destination. Uh, Unload our goods. Right, right quick, and then get back up north. Faster, because it's got the good wind. Only a week. Okay, fine. So if my horse is still in the stables, then you don't have to pay for it. But you do have to pay for the stabling fees. Okay, because I was only intending to keep that horse there for a couple days. <laughs> Why would you even is have it- a horse? <laughs> So I can ride a horse, obviously. The the captain agrees to pay any overdue fees you have when you come back to um, Kenneth. Fine. (laughs) The shit's all over the floor, my dude. I'm gonna go help him. Bastion. Actually, come to think of it, um... He uh, is not going to need an escort for the northern trip because you can hug the coastline. Um, as soon as they, you, you reach the uh, the port, Enzo, you can take a normal passenger ship north immediately. Okay. About a week and a half, or two and a half weeks. But in that case, how will I get my money if my horse is gone? How much the um, the stabling fee would cost? Well, what if what if my horse isn't there anymore? I mean, I didn't tell them I was going to be leaving the horse there for. Oh my god! Three weeks I have a hundred gold. I will buy you a new horse. Okay, fine, fine. God. I probably have a hundred gold. Yeah, I have a hundred gold. Well, fine. they're going to be paying us now because I negotiated fair payment. So whatever that is. Well, it's only going to be after they um, they receive payment of their own. Yeah, I mean, that's fine. But... Because all of their money is invested. Let's see. All right, well, let's go then. I go to a cabin, uh, preferably the cabin that was that was previously claimed by the crew member that died during the fight and uh, prepare for my trip to a car. Okay, wait, hold on. Goblin Man, don't you want your magic item back? (laughs) Or can I have it? What is it? I'm going to start. 
I get my hat of disguises and I put it in my backpack. You have become one. And then I go to the... We are the house. cool kid goblin now, motherfucker. Of disguises, I keep it in my bag. Anyway... Uh... Well, you, just for reference, it looks like sort of like a floppy cap. So it kind of makes you look like an ugly gnome when you're wearing it and not at, don't have it active. Oh, is it a, uh, is it a disguise hat? Uh, yes. Yes. Well, I mean, I feel like you both said something and neither came through. Go to and prepare for the trip to a car. Okay. Cool. You know, hopefully, with no. Uh, what haggling about horses and all this kind of bullshit. I'm gonna so, go find that that elf and introduce myself properly and ask her if she happens to have seen any other elves that look uh, look like me at all. Oh, okay. What? Uh, 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 to uh, uh, visit Aurelia. Aurelia is a is a gray elf, right? Aurelia? No. Uh, She's a half-elf. Ju Julia's character is a gray elf. Aurelia is a half-elf. But it's Inside not clear unclear. what kind of elf. Because okay. like, flaming red hair is kind of unusual even among... Even among, presumably... Roll and investigate against Julia's character. I don't even. <laughs> I gotta go to bed soon. I gotta work tomorrow. Yeah. So. Fair. No. Um. Yes, but my yes, my character. Should, should we introduce our? Because we've never really introduced our. Really. Should we just end it with that introducing our characters? I'm. And make some proper introductions now that you're going to be working together. Yeah. Yeah. yeah fine. I guess. I'm a, a cool kid. <laughs> no. Uh, what did I fucking name my character? Lady Serial okay. Neris M. Hemistasia or something like that? Yeah. Probably. That's not what I wanted to do. Uh, yeah, I'm. Of the Yellow Rose. Order of the Yellow Rose. And uh, as far as I'm concerned, and I'm saying this out loud. That makes me one step cooler than all y'all. You gotta prove yourselves. And then I mm. cast Prestidigitation to make sparks fly out of my wand. I cast spark Prestidigitation and, and have sparks fly out of my hand hands. Hi, I'm Blake. Mm, you just copied what I did. That's not cool. That's no, yours lame. is coming out of your wand. Mine are coming out of my fingertips. I make them come out of my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> I cast prestidigitation to make my to turn my hair black and then brown and then back to blonde. All right, he's cool. Who's next? Who's gonna impress me next? Uh, okay, I am Aurelia de Zafrani di Viana, Princess of Viana. Boom! I totally outrank you. She doesn't say All that right. out loud, but you know right. her eyes. Her eyes say it. Yeah, but she's only half an elf, so... I mean... Mm -hmm. She's cooler than everyone else, though. Well, yes. that's probably a half-elf of one of the lesser elves... tribes oh. down here in the south. Well, I'll try not to judge her too harshly. <laughs> yes. And and if anyone's listening, she will go on to explain the history of family. And, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, okay. How she uh, is Goblin, the, the true true heir to the the principality of Viana, but has been usurped mm -hmm. by her older mm -hmm. brother, mm -hmm. who is mm -hmm. you know actually mm -hmm. a legitimate child instead of a bastard, and also older than her. But you know those things don't matter. Sorry, I fell asleep. <laughs> You can tell I stopped paying gonna, attention when you said like the first three that's, syllables that's of the name. Literally impossible. Elves don't sleep, but okay. <laughs> I went into my four-hour trance. Quieter members of the team, story please introduce themselves hours. now. To give your own story, like some folks on board, but 
still a name would be nice. And sometimes Spice Merchant for Red Interest in the Seven Reaches of the Empire. Make all of your acquaintances. I like your hat. It is very nice. It is a pretty cool hat. It is efficient for what it does. I just look around at the Motley Crew or uh, me and just kind of go, I'm Grunash. Just. That's all I say. Alright, so. Serial. Ari. Or. Oriola? How do you pronounce that? I'm like, I'm. I'm. Out of character. Aurelia? Actually. Yes, Aurelia. Aurelia. So, like, in character, my character would say all, all of the. All of the names correctly. So Aurelia, Brunash, um, what was the goblin's name? Nako. Nako, and Serial. Got it. Yeah. No, you need to say my uh, full name. Yeah. No, that's not happening. Well, uh, I guess I can't be bothered to remember your name, Pond. It's literally. Uh, yes. I mean, I I, one I personally don't mind being referred to by by my first name, but you probably should, you know, include princess in front of it. If uh, you can also, that. not gonna happen. Cool. Okay. Well, let's see. Okay. There, we're just... While you're all making your introductions, you also learn the captain's name. Albert not Einstein. on purpose. <laughs> <laughs> else you, you read his name when he um signs the contract act. yeah nice are we getting what, a long what rest? is his name did you did you say it because if you did I, I couldn't hear captain stamos oh john hi <laughs> hi john stamos. okay <laughs> <laughs> I'm very happy right now. He's already the coolest motherfucker on this shit. He did severely wound one. Yeah, he's okay. Yeah, I guess. kill yeah. another one. Yeah, he's pretty neat. Earned having a cool name. All right. Um, that is fair. I still bug him about where about the location of my mouse. Like, he has no idea. You all no. He was not present when you were abducted. Okay. Okay. Point me to somebody who was, so that way they can give me my damn right. mouse back. Hey, hey, pawn scum. Um, listen, I don't know. How hey, to tell hey, you this, this is an A B A and B conversation, so see yourself out of this. Thanks. Okay, but I have an owl, and I'm just trying to tell you my magic owl probably ate your stupid mouse. Okay, bye. <laughs> and then I leave because he told me to leave. Or they the, the, the told me to leave. The who actually abducted you <sighs> does uh, say, oh yeah, I guess there was a mouse in the room. <laughs> okay. And... <laughs> left it there because... Mice don't make great crew members? Testing the room. I hate... Everybody on this boat, except for the people that you also abducted and the captain. Aww. I also tolerate you. I mean, yeah. really, it doesn't hate anybody, except for her evil older brother, Lucio. <laughs> I do not yet have enough information to make an assessment. All right, so I can't, I take it we're getting a long rest. Well, uh, it sounds like it's about time to wrap up. Yeah, you were saying. Yeah, I gotta get to bed so yeah. I can be angry at children tomorrow. I'd planned a second encounter in case we got through the first one fast enough. And whether they like it or not. Claim all of the single bed, uh, yes, all of the rooms uh, on the lower deck. Oh, yeah, I'm. The remaining crew has to squeeze into the uh, barracks. 
Listen, they kidnapped me. The least they, they can do is let me have my own goddamn room. They're not complaining <laughs> to you. Good. To us, okay. Cool. Good. It's not my fault. I'm did, taking the dead guys. If man. they did get, <laughs> if they did complain, they were gonna have to dance a little bit. I would have eldritch blasted at their feet, not hitting them. Just make them dance a little bit. That's technically torture. It's not. No, it's not. It is technically torture. Cannot believe the conversation. Legally, that is him. torture. I'm just letting you know. I'm not even I hurting them. Legally, it's still torture. <laughs> Question is. To Torture legal in the empire. <laughs> <laughs> well, Almost certainly, night, yeah. folks. <laughs> well, uh, the, the empire is not enlightened beyond its time. Let's just put it like put it that way. Well, in that case, good night. Character and also myself. Just to be clear, my character it's... would not actually do that. They are chaotic good. Oh, so am I. That's why we get as long as the house is on fire. <laughs> and also why my bird ate your mouse. My magic bird. Your bird did not eat my mouse. My mouse is still back in my room in my hotel. Because that idiot doesn't realize that it's a good mouse. And a good friend. You know what? You should learn this trick and then I start making my owl pop in and out of reality. <laughs> Using the uh, ability to dismiss and r make it come back afterwards. I, hey, Julia, I also, do me a favor. I also uh, summon Julia's owl. Julia, um, do me a favor and get me spell. and roll me a, uh, a wisdom check. Why? Just do it. You're not a GM. Just, just do it. No, just no. do it. No, uh, no, I'm you not gonna do it. You get have out of here. You have to I, because I'm using a thing. No, I don't. I close the door and the lock it and go take my. Trans snap. Yeah, if she can't hear you, you can't use it. Actually, yes, also, I can. I, get... I can still completely use this if she can't. I also get advantage on that, so I don't know why you'd want to do that. Just, uh, just no, roll it's... the wisdom yeah. save. No, uh, you, go you, away. You, you can't. You can't use it if she can't hear you. Yeah, it doesn't say that. Go away. Wait, what? Which spell are you trying to use? I'm not using a spell. I'm using a class feature. Oh, I go thought you were using suggestion. No, I'm not using. Suggestion. Go away. I'm not Julia. doing this. I'm no, going to bed. Julia. Hey, actually, good night. For real, I'm going to bed. Have fun. I'm not making that. Okay, Kalon, roll wisdom. All right. I don't. I'll roll wisdom, whatever. It would only last. Julia, anything. it would literally only last a round. I'm locking my door. Okay, Leave I think alone. you should roll wisdom. I'm rolling wisdom. That's what I'm doing. Locking my door. Proficient. Yes, I am. Why is it asking if I'm proficient when I tell it that I, and it's in there that I am proficient? Okay, so I'm going to suggest that you stop harassing Julia's character <laughs> but I'm pretty for the sure next eight I'm, hours. I'm pretty sure I made your, the DC. No, you didn't. What's the save DC? Um, 15. How is it 15? You don't have a plus 5 to your modifier, do you? No, I get a bonus from some other thing. I don't know, dude. I'm going to bed. Good night. <laughs> Unless Good Bobbin night. needs needs. Actually, something. it is 14. Ah! All right. Yeah, I, I, was, I was lying to try to trick Kalon. <laughs> <laughs> your sheets are public. I just want everyone to remember that. Uh, to you, not to... I can't yeah, see Yeah, I can't sheets. see... I can't... I can only see bio Don't and info. See because I've got, uh, the... I've clicked the show to players button. Yeah, yeah it, but it I... show... Like, it, it shows the sheets... Them, like, or, sorry, it shows that the characters exist, and you can click on, like, and see their bio and picture, but you can't actually see their, um, stats and stuff unless you're able to modify uh, them. Yeah, it's kind of a weird that. I'm gonna make a quick edit then. Something I was. All right, but are we getting a long rest? Is it, this is important. Has. Okay. So I get my. It's going to be several days before the next thing happens. Okay. So I get my. Uh, I get my flight back. I get my the spell slot I used back. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Do we get, Do we get an amount back. of experience, or are you going to be 
leveling us up like according to the story or something instead of giving out so i go with the story yeah, yeah. okay cool i, I prefer that because it's less math back. that everybody has to take care of yeah it's easier so i was asking because i really want to level up to level four so i can uh get elven accuracy how do i get it oh, hp power. back what else? In the fight. oh i get an ability score improvement and... Uh, I get another cantrip. I get another spell. Hey. Should you get my HP back? Level, yeah, four is one. Stuff. level four is a big level for me. Currently. I mean, level four is a big level for every because yeah. you get uh, you get your ability score. Get HP back when I from a long rest. Yes, you do get that also. But no, you I'm get everybody on, an ability score. Increase, I'm debating so. on taking a feat instead of uh, a feat. Of, uh, doing the yeah, thing. well, that's the nice thing about having an odd number. My best skill because I can just take a feat that increases it. Yeah, by one. I was, you guys I was are aware that you haven't leveled yet. Yeah, right? I know. Okay. No, I know. no, we know. I'm just I'm, <laughs> making I'm, sure. Yeah, no, but I already know what I want to take at level. Uh, I yeah, I, want I to take Elven accurate. I think at level four, uh, instead of taking the ability and score increase, I'm going to take the alert feat because that's amazing. Uh, I get you get a plus five bonus to initiative. You can't be surprised while you're conscious, and other uh, creatures don't gain advantage on attack rolls as a result of being hidden from me. So basically, fuck you, rogues. Fair enough. Yeah, yeah, pretty All right. much. All right. Well, I'm going to stop the recording now.